Hello my friends, welcome back to my channel. It has been a minute. It has been a minute. I am so sorry that I haven't posted in a while. I got so, so sick, <laughs> so sick. And then the very next week after I was sick, I had to do performance reviews at work, which consisted of me talking to all 10 of my direct reports for 45 minutes straight that week. <laughs> And I had no voice, no voice. So I took some time obviously to rest. My voice is feeling much better. I actually have some throat coat tea here with me to help me get back into the swing of things with my first video back. But yeah, thank you so much for your patience. If you were wondering where I was, I was just resting and recharging, but I am back today and I'm so excited because I have a box from one of my favorite small business diamond painting companies, Muni Made. I'm so excited. I'm going to open this. I have not even touched it. I've had it since I've been sick and it's just been sitting there tempting me to open it, but I have been waiting. I've been waiting and I'm so excited to open this and unbox it and show you guys what I got. So without any further ado, grab your cozy drink and we will dive into this unboxing from Muni Made. Look at how cute! I love the tissue paper. <laughs> Here we go. Oh my gosh, the packaging is so cute! Look at this! Oh, she sent me a little card! Oh my goodness. So cute. She said that this is one of her original kits and they're working on making some upgrades and changes to their production line. I'm so excited to talk more about that because I've been talking with her directly and I'm just going to say it now, her passion and like love for what she does, the kits that she makes, it's honestly like so much fun to see. Oh my goodness, it's so fun. I'm so excited to dig into all of this stuff. Canvas, ooh, so excited. Cute little keychain, what? Okay, amazing. So many cute little goodies. Okay, so I have purchased from Muni Made before. I was absolutely obsessed with their Beauty and Chaos. I'll put a little photo right here. Canvas that they did last year. And I, I did it, I worked on it like immediately as soon as I got it. I'm pretty sure that was my first small business kit that I've ever purchased and I have no regrets. It was beautiful. I loved it so much. I completed it last year. It was a dream to work on. I just loved everything about it. It really made me like a believer in doing small business diamond painting kits as well. I'm sorry if you can hear my cat diving into the box with the tissue paper. I should have expected that to happen. But with any Muni Made kit, you can opt to get a tool kit or you don't need to. I believe with some of the like their newer releasers, you can opt to get like a premium kit, which will include also a, a diamond painting tray, which I'm so excited to open this. And then you can also opt to get like a dust cover as well. So I love that it comes with like different options. For someone like me who does like already have a ton of tools toolkits and stuff. I usually don't need any of these things, although it's really fun to get them. <laughs> and I love that you can just do that as an add-on item, which is really great. Let me zoom in here and we will go ahead and first dive into the toolkit itself. So let me just pour it all out here. So fun. Oh my goodness. This kit obviously comes with everything that you need. We have a diamond painting pen. As always, this is what you can use to diamond paint. Put your putty in. Use your drill tray to place those diamonds into the tray and then pick them up. It comes with a multi-placer here and then another one right here. Love that. We also have tweezers and they are pink. I cannot tell y'all how excited I am right now. I have always wanted pink tweezers and I never thought that I would get them in a Muni Made kit, but I'm so happy that I have them. Tweezers are excellent to have for square kits. I do like working with tweezers to help pick up some of my drills, especially those ABs, placing the ABs. So it comes with a set of tweezers and they're pink. I'm so happy about this. And then here, we have the diamond painting putty. So this is the blue putty. It comes in this really, really cute packaging. The putty is in here. It does come with like a little plastic cover. So make sure to just peel this cover off before you stick in your pen. I don't know if this is an extra or what, but this is a single placer diamond painting pen. I am 1000% obsessed with it. It's so cute. I feel like this is something Elle Woods 
would use to diamond paint if she was a diamond painter, which I'm choosing to believe that she is. <laughs> this is so stinking cute. It's a little single placer. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to put this in my um, collection of other pens. The pom-pom is killing me. <laughs> I'm obsessed. And then we have some washi tape. Oh my goodness, this washi tape is so cute, you guys. It's like pink watercolor stars with like this like gold foil. It's so cute. The little bows and the moons. Are you kidding? This is like so my vibe. I love it. Oh, so cute. And then the cover minder. Okay, I'm sorry. My, my voice is getting like increasingly higher <laughs> as this video is going on, but I'm so obsessed with all of these little goodies. This is by far the cutest cover minder I have now. Uh, it's this like beautiful little pink daisy. It's a thousand percent going on my fridge. <laughs> I don't use cover minders when I'm working on kits, but this is going to be a magnet now that lives on my fridge forever. So shout out to Meanie Maid because this is adorable. So that is everything that came in the kit for this one. I'm, I'm just beyond. I'm in love with all the pink here. Okay, so for those of you who don't know, Muni Maid is not only known for obviously their amazing kits that they have, but also their drill trays are so awesome and they are so loved in the community. And they are a little tricky to get because they fly off the shelves. I'm so excited to open this though and show y'all. Oh my goodness, it's the cutest shade of yellow. <gasps> I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. I love, I don't know if you can tell, it probably maybe looks a little green in the camera, but it's like this pastel yellow and it's so happy making. <laughs> it comes with the Muni Maid brand on the side, which is so cool. And it does have a stopper here at the top. It has a lid. So I just pop this lid off and here's the drill tray. And I think that this is their large size this is a big one you can take the stopper out by just sliding it up like that and now when you're done with any of the drills that you pour in here you can just tip them back into your containers easy peasy and if you want to have that stopper there at any point you just pop it back in there it's a piece of cake i love their drill trays this is such a nice like big size I love using these big sizes for when you're doing a lot of color blocking. I love the fact that it has a cover so that if you didn't get to finish, you can just pop that cover back on and then set it aside and uh, the, the drills won't spill out or anything like that. Oh, this is so cute. I love the drill tray. Love it so, so much. Look at the sticker. Oh my goodness. This is what I love about small businesses. Like the cute as heck stuff that is a part of what you get when you order. I just, it's just so thoughtful and intentional. I love it. Okay, now the canvas. I'm gonna zoom out so we can see it in all of its glory. So I received the Albino Mermaid kit by Kikawa um, as the artist. I am so excited. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's been so long since I've gotten a Muni Maid kit and I'm just like, like, oh, I can't believe that I have another one in my stash. I'm so excited. When I tell y'all, I have just like the most fond memory of ordering my kit from last year, Beauty and Chaos, and being like the most excited about it that I had been, I think ever up until that point about a kit. So I'm just loving that I have another Muni made. <laughs> Here is the tag and the artwork. Is it not beautiful? Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm gonna unravel down like this. Ooh, I'm so excited. Okay. Oh my gosh. Here she is. It looks so good. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm trying to let me let me unroll it all the way and then roll it back. These drills. Oh my gosh, the drills. Okay, okay. One thing at a time, Zoe. Take a deep breath. Okay, so I'm gonna roll it backwards in order to kind of help 
um, laid flat. Oh my goodness gracious, she's so cute. Here is the canvas itself. It may be a little bit hard to see. I'll show you another picture of the actual artwork, but this is so beautiful. The rendering looks so good. A lot of the colors are very like pastels, really bright white kind of colors. So I can appreciate that it's like a little bit hard to see on like the drill, like the canvas itself from like what you're looking at through the screen. But just looking at it myself, I mean, the drill bed is so clear. Actually, let me zoom in and I'll show you. I think you can see a lot better here. You can see all the symbols so clearly. I'll zoom in even more. You can see the symbols look so clearly. Everything, like the grid itself is so clearly defined. I love the rendering. It's stunning. Look how cute her face is. She's just so pretty, her like white blonde hair. And basically, this is just a photo of her taking a little like bath with all these flowers and her hair. And it's just, yeah, this is such a vibe. This is totally my vibe. Mini Mae's canvases are so soft. They're so great. I wouldn't say they're level of like Diamond Art Club soft, but it has this like velvety material. It's a little bit more stiff, but I don't mind. If anything, honestly, I kind of like it. The canvas itself feels just like a little bit more sturdy to work on, if that makes sense. But we have some great like scalloped edges right here that are stitched and finished. So you're not gonna have to worry about fraying. We have the fun little Mini Made logo up here, which I'm fully obsessed with as well. The logo is so cute. <laughs> adorable we have two color code charts one over here and one over here i don't personally use charts that much but it's helpful to have one on both sides again this art is called albino mermaid this is by the artist kikawa we've got muni may's website and the kikawa i love i love this actually the artist's handle and like social media is right here in the corner i thought this was going to be muni maids but it's actually the artists i love that little touch that's so cool this this is the size is really great. I actually kind of tempted to work on this next y'all. I'm like, I have one section left of my current work in progress and I have like two other kits kitted up, <laughs> but I kind of want to drop everything and work on this. So I honestly might. This is a 60 by 60 centimeter. So it's a square. It's not too big, it's not too small. This is a great like, I don't know, I kind of consider this medium size for me personally. I love the size of canvas because it's not gonna go by so fast that I feel like I like barely got to work on it or enjoy working on it, but it's not gonna take me forever to the point where I get burnt out on it. So I love the size. And then also, of course, worth mentioning as well that Muni Made does license their artwork with their artists. So that means that their artists are getting commission, they're getting paid for when um, their artwork is being used and purchased, and we absolutely love that here on this channel. I cannot contain my excitement about the drills. Oh my gosh. We do a sticker sheet we'll go over. Wrapped up in the sticker sheet and drills is also a really great little like pamphlet all about Muni Made. This is so cute. Talking about like, thank you for purchasing. This is something she's always dreamed of having, having her own line of canvases. This is so sweet. Oh my goodness. And then I also really like too, this is something that I feel like Muni Made is kind of known for, being very receptive to feedback and wanting to produce and promote like the best possible quality canvases. To me, even if you're not diamond art club quality, which I'm sure like that's probably a very hard standard to live up to. The fact that anyone in their small business is willing to be collaborative with their consumer and to receive feedback, I, I just think is so commendable. To me, that always sets a business apart from others that maybe are defensive or don't wanna hear from their consumer. I have like so much love for the way that Muni May runs their business. There's also a step-by-step -step instructions on if this is your first diamond painting, like how to do it, how to go about it, which is really helpful. There's also some information on the back here about if you don't have enough drills or their licensing, rendering, reselling, returns, just like a great like little one pager on all the things you need to know about your kit. Love that. And here we have this sticker sheet. Okay, I'm gonna zoom in again so we can take a look at this sticker sheet. Okay, so here's the artwork. Here's another like photo of the artwork. Can you understand 
my love. <laughs> it's just so pretty. I love the look on her face. I love the just the color palette. It's the most like calming and serene color palette. I'm obsessed with the flowers, the pinks, the watercolor vibes, the purples. This is just the most adorable artwork. Love it so much. And then we have the sticker sheet. So this is a 46 color kit and it is squares, which I love personally more than rounds. I'm a square girly. <laughs> so we've got 42 colors and then we have four AB drills, which I cannot wait to look at. And yeah, as you can see, and as I'm sure you could see from the artwork itself, I mean, it's going to be every shade of pink under the sun. A lot of yellows and like really pretty pastel purples, you can tell up here. So pretty. I am excited to work on this kit. I'm so excited. So cute. Okay. And then we have the drills. Y'all, are you joking? Like, if you know me at all, <laughs> Is this not my dream palette? It's too beautiful. So Muni Made Drills do come in individual baggies. So here's 151. We actually, I think we have maybe a couple 151s. Here's another one. And so they'll come in these baggies, which is awesome because some people prefer to kit up using the baggies. And if you are that kind of person, well, there you go. It's already in the baggie. And then all you have to do is obviously match up the number with the number sticker and you can pop that right on the baggie if that's what you want to do. Personally, what I will do is I have my own kitting up system that I really like and I'll just take these drills and I'll pour them into my preferred system and then I'll label those organizers with the stickers. But I just really like the baggies. <laughs> They're a little bit like easier to work with than the plastic bags that other kits come with. I don't know, there's just something like easier about this that I really like. But look at these colors. I am gonna be a little chaotic and just like take them all out like this and show y'all because I'm just gonna stick them right back into a plastic bag. Look at how beautiful. Look at that yellow. I like that yellow. <laughs> Here's some more. This is like a full on boost of serotonin. Like this whole palette right here. I can't believe I get to work on this kit. <laughs> this is a dream. I love this color too, this like darker uh, pink right here. This pretty like peachy orange. Here's some more. Y'all, when I'm done with this kit, I cannot wait to post a photo of it. It's gonna look so beautiful. And the drill quality, by the way, I forgot to mention this earlier, but the drill quality is so good. Okay, like take a look at this. Tell me if you can even see a single trash drill in there cause I sure don't. <laughs> it's such good quality, it's so sparkly, beautiful. Oop, and I see our ABs. I'll wait to show those, but here are the rest. I love this peach color, it's like orangey, peachy, so pretty. And here are ABs. So we have like classic, this looks like 141. It's that beautiful like white, just like clean, pristine, gorgeous white AB. Here is this beautiful color pink. Okay, not to be like comparing and to just like spill some tea, but right now I'm working on, I think it's an older, an older kit from a beloved company. And they have this same color AB in the kit and it's rounds. I don't really know if that matters, but the AB quality is so not good. <laughs> It's like really murky and kind of muddy and I'm just like a little disappointed in the quality. It's not a big deal. Like I'm not so picky that everything has to be perfect with my kits, but I just, when I look at this and see how good the drill quality is, I, I get so excited and I'm just so impressed with the quality. This yellow, <gasps> this yellow is so fun. Do you see how like fun and shimmery? the finish is. Love it. 
And this one, this is the same color in the same kit that I was just talking about. I, it's two different pinks. It's this pink and then this one in these other kit, this other kit that I'm working on. And this one is also very murky. And like, look at how beautiful. No murkiness, the, the quality of like the shimmer of the AB is, is stunning. Also, I love how much of this color <laughs> there is because it's such a nice color. It kind of matches my nails. Love it. This is absolutely like my dream palette. I cannot wait to get started on this. All right, y'all. Well, that is the unboxing of this amazing Muni Made kit. One thing I wanted to mention, and I kind of mentioned it a little briefly, like in the beginning, but one thing I wanted to talk about was that the owner of Muni Made is in the process of making a bunch of improvements to their kits. Um, I believe things like a softer canvas material is being worked on, a like even tighter like drill bed so that your drills are fitting even more closely together. All of those things are being worked on right now. She is so passionate about making improvements, having the best quality canvases and drills and just overall like demo painting experience for her consumers possible. And I love that so much. She was telling me that she was gonna send me a kit when some of those improvements were made so I'm excited to work on this one soon maybe I'll then like talk about it my experience with it and then work on the other one with some of those awesome improvements and sort of talk about the differences but either way I just have to shout out Muni Made and their deep desire to come out with an excellent product that is really worth your money and your time and your investment. I think that just like really sets apart their business for me and I will be a lifelong supporter. So shout out to Meanie Made. I will link them down below. Please go check out the products that they have. Um, support them on Facebook, Instagram, all that stuff. They are just the sweetest and have wonderful product so highly highly recommend muni made thank you so so much for sending me this kit i'm so excited to work on it <laughs> follow me along on instagram or tiktok if you want to see maybe some of my progress on this kit i can't wait to share about it and um thank you so much for watching my video thank you for checking out this unboxing let me know your thoughts and i'll see you soon in my next one bye y'all